Welcome to the latest installment of Chord by Chord, the series designed to build your understanding of harmony in the fretboard. In the last lesson, we went over various E major voicings. In this lesson, we're going to go over B major. Remember that a major triad is made up of three notes, the root, the third, and the fifth. Example one shows us the notes in a B major chord. Note that the key of B major has five sharps, F sharp, C sharp, G sharp, D sharp, and A sharp. Now, B major isn't as easy to play as, say, A or C or E, which all have these easy to access open chords, um, but you can basically take any A shape and move it up two frets to get a B shape. Example 2A is essentially the A open chord moved up two frets to get B major. Example 2B gives us an alternate fingering for that same voicing. Example 2C shows us yet another alternate fingering and makes use of just the top four strings. In this voicing, the fifth F sharp is on the bottom. This type of voicing that's just on the top four strings is useful when playing with other instruments that are covering the low end. Example 3A shows us a bar chord at the seventh fret. Example 3B shows us that same voicing but with a different fingering where you wrap your thumb around the neck to reach the 6th string. This fingering eliminates the need for the full bar. Due to the shape of my hand, I'm not able to get that first string to play when using that fingering. Examples 4 and 5 show us two compact voicings that make use of just the top three strings. Here's example 4. Here's example 5. You should now know a bunch of B major voicings across the fretboard. One song that makes use of B major is Born in the USA by Bruce Springsteen. Born down in a dead man's town The first kick I took was when I hit the ground End up like a dog that's been beat too much Till you spend half your life just covering up Born in the USA I was Thanks for watching. In the next lesson, I'll show you how to transition from the 1 to the 5 in the key of A major.